Hey guys, what's up? The Gaming Bunny here, and today I'm going to show you guys the Skull Trooper in Fortnite Save the World. So right now, I was just opening up a birthday llama that I did a few missions to get, and um, I get a purple choice, and it's between Snowstalker Jonesy, Jonesy um, which is kind of like the Alpine Ace, and I already have a legendary version, or Skull Trooper Jonesy, and as soon as I saw this, I was extremely happy, and I decided to pick up the camera and record. I'm obviously going to choose Skull Trooper Jonesy, and I'm extremely happy right now because I have been trying to get Skull Trooper for basically the entirety of the birthday event. As soon as I saw that um, you were able to, I've been trying to um, get as many birthday llamas as possible because I'm only allowed to do 10 missions with the reward of um, Skull Trooper, or with the reward of a birthday llama. So right now I have a choice between Special Forces Banshee or Urban Slow Headhunter. I have a legendary Urban Slow Headhunter, so I'm going to go with Special Forces Banshee. But, um, yeah, I've been working extremely hard doing 10 missions a day just to try and go for Skull Trooper or Ghoul Trooper or even Renegade Raider. But the one I wanted the most was Low Key Skull Trooper. Um, and I'm really happy I got this because I don't even know how many missions I've been doing, but it has been a lot. So that will be my main, um, character that I will use. I'm going to go ahead and change to it. Um, I'm actually really happy right now. That is amazing. Because I I was getting all the other characters from Halloween. As you can see, I have these ones. Um, and I do believe there's one more. Oh, yeah, I have Cat Structured Penny, a legendary version. But there we go. And I will level him up a lot because he will be my main, the main person I use. Um, I don't have that much XP, but I mean, it'll be enough to level him, to level him up a bit. And yeah, so I just wanted to thank everyone for the support on my videos. It means a lot to me, guys. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and evolve him. It means a lot to me, all the support that everyone's been showing me. Um, I really love it. But if you guys want to know my opinions on the Battle Hound coming back, at first I was like kind of surprised and I didn't think they were going to bring it back. But now I think it's fine because the damage has already been done of it, like not being a, uh, not being a rare skin anymore. So I feel like it's fine that it came back. But, um... There we go, guys. Uh, power level 49 has a um, decent amount of health and stuff. But I'm honestly really happy right now because, yeah, I, as I said earlier, every single day since this event started, I've been playing for hours and hours every day just trying to get the Skull Trooper. And I, it finally happened. Um, I was, uh, it finally happened. I've been trying for so long. So extremely happy right now. And if I go to the Fort Nightmare set, um, obviously there, oh, it won't like give me the option of putting um, him in there. But yeah, I've Cash Rocker Penny, um, this one, and Beetle Jess. No, Beetle, so yeah, I can't remember. Ranger Beetle Jess, I think. Yeah, Ranger Beetle, Ranger <laughs> Beetle Jess. That's a tongue twister for me. But, um, and here, if you complete all three of these, if you get all three of these survivors and put them in the collection book, you do, in fact, get the Jackal Launcher, which was one of the rare skins in the game. And right now, I am, um, well, I have this one. I haven't put it in, I haven't put it in the collection book. I'll do it along with that. And I'm just really trying to get this Legendary Smasher, because if I do, I will, in fact, make a video on getting the Jackal Launcher and probably leveling up that, leveling up that schematic a bit. But yeah, this is great. I've been trying to do this for a while, and it finally happened. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hope you have a great day, and peace.